Right. That's working. Oh, I'm not gonna yawn. I'm not gonna yawn. Oh, that habit needs to go away. Hey, folks. Sorry for And finally, I've gotten off my duff and decided to... I've uh, picked out a game from my backlog of many, many Toho games that I wanted to play on camera for a while. And decided, hey, you know what? Let's go. <laughs> so here I am. Um, so, while I'm at it, a little bit of a... While I'm checking my OBS here for a second... Okay, everything's running good. <laughs> Sorry. Mid mid scuff. Anyway. <clears throat> a bit of a precursor um, talk here. My channel's old. Not as old as some of the other ones on YouTube, but still fairly old. There was once upon a... I, I grew up with uh, Let's Players, and watching that ever since my high school years, and ever since then I've always been a lover of them, but, you know, I've been watching more VTubers these days, but there's a small part of me that still kind of does uh, things in such a way that, you know, old uh, Let's Players did. I'm not going to call it Let's Playing anymore, it's just me being an idiot. So we'll just keep it at that. <laughs> um, and one of my first uh, attempts when I finally, a, a younger Seraph, back in his uh, wee little shithead, well not wee little shithead, this is more like after my high school years. Well, uh, a couple years after. Um, one of the first uh, games that he played was um, from the same devs over here. Um, that game was uh, another Toho fan game, uh, Yo Yo Kengeki Muso, featuring Yo. Now, since then, um, I have uh, done a couple of other uh, games and whatnot on my channel, a good number of them Toho, and I and I want to keep doing mostly Toho related video playthroughs just for the fun of it something for me to enjoy because i have a gigantic backlog somewhat and it's only slowly growing how about i just peck away at it right so i've decided for me to you know come back and get back into a swing of uh doing videos uh, again for the fun of it i think it would be a little bit poetic that i decided to play one of the next installments from that particular dev <clears throat> so here i am I think this and there's one more other um, Toho game from that dev, I think Toho New World. I'll consider playing that one on camera at a later date. But for now, we're gonna start here and see if I can... I could have on camera too late I did. Hmm. <sighs> Some habits never go away, don't they? Um, I've decided that this is going to be the one I'm going to be doing cool, let's go. Now... I've only loaded the game up a couple times to make sure that it's running properly, so don't mind me. Where am I starting though? Okay. As a Toho fan myself, not a not, not a super geek or anything, but I my the Scarlet Devil Mansion crew was always my favorite. Admittedly, Sakuya, primarily. But I have a soft spot for Remy as well, because these two are dorks. <laughs> kind of. Depending on if it's canon or fanon um, interpretations, but I've always liked both of these characters, and just everybody else in the Scarlet Devil Mansion uh, series of characters. Granted, uh, Marisa also has a bit of a soft spot in my heart, but, you know, if I had to if I had to narrow down the list, it'd be this one. This. How about... Well, it's clear that this is going to be a somewhat lengthy project now, isn't it? Unless the game is short, kind of like um, Yo-Yo Kengeki Muso. Uh, we'll start with Remy. How about that? Now... <laughs> <clears throat> see, my lady, the sun has already risen. Let's go back inside now. Mm, I don't feel like moving. Carry me. You're not a child anymore. I might be so bold. Haven't you been a bit too lazy these days? More than usual, I mean. Well, uh, that's what happens when you're bored. Nothing to do. Not now. Simply not true. Why, just the other day, there was that strange incident that Reimu handily took, <laughs> took care of uh, without breaking a sweat, I assume. And even if something did happen during that during the day, it's not like I could fight at full power. Blech. Are there even any um, fiends or monsters out there worthy of my attention? Well, there's certainly no shortage of yokai around here. Yeah, but I could tear my way through a million of those weaklings and no one would care. 
She has a point. <laughs> what I really want is to fight a yokai so mighty and so powerful that beating it would make me a legend. Mm, that's a tall order, Remy. Aiming high is always my lady. If that's the case, you might be interested in this. Is this that Tengu newspaper? Hmm. Strange shadows sighted on the mountain. But this picture is so blurry. And the article goes on to say no one has even seen the thing. Sounds like a hoax. Maybe. But everybody in the village was talking about it. I heard somebody found a footprint in the mountains. And some fields were vandalized too. Is that really the best picture they could get? Mm, the monster seems like it may be rather cautious. The Tengu are doing their best to find it. But they've come up empty-handed so far, which is a little bit surprising considering how, considering how fast certain Tengu is, like Aya. I figure she would have seen it. Mm, very well. Whether or not it turns out to be true, at least this will let me kill some time. So this is where we're starting, huh? Splendid! I'll gather as much information as I can about the monster tonight. Now, come along, my lady. The sun is already up. If you stay out any longer, you'll only be harming yourself. Fine, fine, I'll go to bed. Is this what humans say when they say, uh, uh this is, is this what humans mean when they say good things come to those who wait? I suppose you'll find out soon enough, won't you? Then, I bid you good night. <clears throat> so this is where we're starting off, huh? Phew, I slept like a log. Now back to business. Or now it's back to business. Zakuya? Zakuya? Huh, that's strange. Has she not returned home yet? But who else have... Who else would have left those newspapers on the table for me? Uh, nah. Hold on. Hold on. Listen with me for a minute. Let me, let me bump up my, my audio. Sorry, this might be a bit loud for, for you to hear me. Let's just listen to this for a minute. We gotta appreciate it. Hmm, not bad. Not bad at all. I'm gonna have to tune down the uh, sound again though. <laughs> just so it's not overpowering me or I'm not overpowering the sound too much either. I dig that thing though. Or this iteration of it. Now, let me see. Yeah, just like uh, Kengeki, um, Yo Yo Kengeki Muso Ryu. Hmm. It looks like these issues have articles about the monster. Uh, articles. Uh, excuse me. Hmm. It looks like these issues have articles about those monsters everybody's been talking about lately. Let's see... Mokele... Memesis? Membeep? I got tongue twisted, excuse me. A menace's Misty Lake. Yeah. Here we've got... Uh, guided by the Light. Seems about Will-O-Wisps haunting the Bamboo Forest. And here's another one. Seal of the Python Shattered. Looks like there's some trouble afoot in Genbu Ravine. Hmm. I don't know what um, sounds more suspect. These monsters or this reporting? Well, the sun's almost down and I can't say I have anything better to do. Maybe I should check out the lake first. And so we start. <laughs> now, what I was saying... Yeah, never mind, hold on. <laughs> For now. I might as well head uh, to the lake. There is an observation deck on the opposite shore. And I'm going to sit there and wait until... Okay, late. <laughs> Shows its face. I got tongue twisted again. I'll have to look at that later in post. I haven't really had a, a chance to go all out lately. I feel like maybe the quiet life is making me lose my edge a little. I guess I'll just have to shake off that, um, oh, sorry, 
ch shake off that indolence by beating up a goon or two, a uh, two-bit, any two-bit goon who have uh, the bad fortune of uh, crossing my paths today. Let's get going. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Now, what I was trying to say earlier is the um, the controls do feel a fair bit floaty and loose, kinda, kinda like um, Yo Yo King Kimus. Except Remy seems to be able to glide just a bit. Let me get a custom to this for a minute. Skill, skill, menu. Well, yeah, we know the menu. Equipment. Equipment. Okay. Well, that's different from mm, King Kimuso. Vampire turn, vampire heart. Spell card. Okay, hold on. Okay. Okay. So, not really Gunganir and just an AoE around here. Okay. Alright, let's just go. <laughs> I spent too much time yapping on. Let's just move this along because I do want to... While I am trying to get into a, a habit, again, for recording, I also don't want to... I also don't wanna don't wanna have too lengthy of uh, videos. I'd like to keep them at least marginally within the length I prefer as far as videos go. So we'll try to do that. Hmm? So how am I gonna do this? Maybe we'll go by one stage at a time, preferably, and then we'll segment them off. And hopefully I get them done within a decently timely fashion. <laughs> That's not like 30 minutes of video, but if it does, I'm sorry. <laughs> I yap too much. Oop. First gear, bring up the menu and equip it. What's this? Sharp nails. A uh, little bit of crit rate. A little bit of drop rate and a little bit of attack. I mean, I'll take it for the attack. Such a little uh, crit rate is not really all that helpful. What am I looking at? Not all that helpful in small quantities. Not that helpful. Hmm. Not really all that helpful within small quantities. So. We've got that, anyway. Sorry, slight destruction there on this side. Oops, shit. I'm really not- Whoa, hello. I have a dive. Great. Cool. Good to know. I actually can just initiate that way. <laughs> Good to know. Uh, I'm gonna be stupid and overuse that, aren't I? I am. I am definitely gonna be stupid and overuse that. Approach. This one... Uh, ba -ba -ba. More HP. That's literally all it is. Okay. <clears throat> Good to know. I hate to say it, and I'm gonna apologize for this ahead of time, but I'm pretty sure these videos are gonna be a bit on the lengthy side, so I'm sorry for any of the uh, viewers of mine who happen to. Well, most of my viewers are friends anyway, and maybe the occasional new subscribers as well. And thank you, by the way, for those of you who happen to be here for some reason. I don't know why, but hey, thanks anyway. Thanks for humoring this uh, lazy old crow for a little bit and actually making him get off his ass to go do some stuff. But I'm going to completely forget what I was going to say in my train of thought. Anyway. Um, <laughs> that's a little embarrassing. But I'm going to try to semi keep a consistency. Obviously, I'm going to be following my same rule as always. I'm not. I'm not, uh, I'm gonna do any recordings on a day where I'm like, eh, whatever. Best do it when I'm feeling in a, you know, decent mood to just chill and play something. So, it'll be like that. And again, it looks to me like this is going to pan out to be a fairly lengthy per video deal. Ooh, too far. How am I supposed to measure that? That's a very far dive, actually. And then in other, in other instances, it's short. Hold on. Hmm. I might have to just keep using it until I get it. I can't 100% get a proper measure on how far or short that dive is. Hmm. 
But yeah, that happens to be the case so far. So I guess this is where I start on my attempting attempting very poorly to hold myself accountable. This is where I'm going to start with uh excuse me. This is where I'm gonna start with uh slowly punching through my backlog of Toho games. Now there is something I've been meaning to talk about as far as like what I wanted to do for channel content. I did try to make a uh, channel update video and just pick a game, just a yap, and play one while I'm yapping, but uh, yeah, in my usual fashion, I didn't check my uh, settings, my audio settings from my mic and all this other stuff prior to that, so by the time I finished, you know, lightly editing what I needed to, and then um, just getting it out to quality test the uh, the, the listen back to it, I found that the audio for my mic was not where I wanted it to be. Uh, so here I am, I'm gonna just go over these things while I'm playing here instead. <laughs> Sorry. Sometimes I just have to keep doing things off by the cuff instead, and it feels a little bit more, more natural for me to do it this way anyway. I need something to talk about while I'm playing, and usually I'm stuck for topics because I'm too busy tunnel visioning. Tunnel <laughs> visioning. When, uh, Playing and I'm in the I'm in the middle of it. I'll usually just tunnel vision like crazy, so that's a bad habit of mine. <clears throat> I used to be able to uh, multitask just fine, but other cases not so much. How many brooches do I have? Okay, so that, those are for brooches. Uh, huh. Nothing different there though. I mean, we'll use it. In before we find out there's a shop system, why are you behind me? Oop. I have to readjust to this top-down perspective again. Jeez. I did enjoy King Gekimo so then. I wonder if I should just replay that. No, maybe I won't. I mean, look, it's still on my channel. You can, you can look at it if you want, but I warn you, I was... Okay, look, I'm not professional now. I'm still... I wasn't that much more professional back then, but it's there. I'm not hiding it for any reason. <laughs> I've decided to leave a, a certain set of my old videos there just for the sake of... Mm, I kind of want to leave it there. These are these are my more fond playthroughs. And then other stuff I've decided to just uh, private and archive because I decided, eh, you know what, just in case I'm gonna leave that the way it is because we should know by now how finicky in copyright and YouTube can be at times, so we're just gonna have to leave it there. And I've decided, you know, yeah, whatever. Now, this doesn't necessarily matter to me in the end, in spite of that, because, well, I don't monetize my stuff. I do have the option to monetize if I want to, don't get me wrong. I could. I won't. <laughs> not at the moment. It's not something I've actively thought to do. It just doesn't, um... It doesn't hit me as something as something I want to do. Would be cool, yeah, but no. This is this is a hobby channel. So I'm just gonna keep it as such, you know? That's uh, more or less what I've decided. Oh my god, there's a one HP difference between the two of these scarves. Fine. Okay. Whatever you say, game. Whatever you say. Why not? Oop. Well, this is in the lower spot. We need to go across a bridge for that. Oop. Hello. Goodbye. Ah. Random fairy on the side. I hate to do a no damage on this. What, what can you say? Oh my god. <laughs> for real? Negative to crit. I don't care about that, so that's fine. I'll take that for the extra attack power. Right now, in such low quantities, crit doesn't really matter. That's the thing about crit builds. Even if you're going to do crit builds, you need a, a certain threshold for consistency. And I'm not worried about that right now. Mm, the last rays of sunset are still are stinging me. Still stinging me a bit. Did I come out too early? Um, after all? Mm. Was that a noise just now? Hmm. Maybe it was just my imagination. Sure hope so, Remy. Sure hope so. Crows! 
<laughs> crows, they still kept those bottles in here. Why? <laughs> Not the diving crows. Yeah, the uh, the, the movement still feels, feels very, very, very floaty. I need to like readjust to that, and I'm not going to use my spell card just yet, because I'm stingy. Stingy as in I don't typically use these things anyway, unless it's a boss fight. Your man is just fine without it, we don't need it, it's fine, we don't need it. Not yet. It's fine. I'm terrible as a gamer, I'm not god awful. Yet. Not yet. Not. Uh, what do we got here? Mokele Membe menaces Misty Lake. Creature witnessed in the water, but suddenly vanished. Is that Harambe? Or a Sasquatch? It's gotta be Harambe. This is. Oh my god, that's what happened to Harambe all along. He came to Gensokyo. Or uh, maybe he didn't. Who knows? Uh, let's see. Human Village plans monster tour to the lake. Giant monsters, threat or menace. And this newspaper really, really needs to work on their catch line, no, their, their, their titles. It's not really eye-catching, now is it? Oh, Luna. Uh, I'm bored. How long do I have to wait here? Hey, you. Sorry, I'm kinda busy right now, actually. I'm busy with what? What is there to even do out here? Well, if you must know, I'm keeping an eye on Scarlet Devil Mansion and the surrounding area, too. Whoa, 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 you're the vampire. So I am. Do you have any business with us? Uh, the people are saying that Mokele... <laughs> I'm gonna try to stumble over my tongue to say that. ...appears in the lake near Scarlet Devil Mansion. Everybody in Gensokyo is talking about it, so I wanted to be the one to catch it. I'm aware of that rumor, yes. But see, that creates a problem for me. I don't like it when somebody snatches my prey right under my right out from under me. Oh wait. Change your plans. If it's a Nova Bar's whole battle you're looking for, I'm ready to go. What no? <laughs> Come here. Oh, I think she parried. Excuse me. Sorry, but I'm gonna I'm gonna play Remy the way I did back in um, the first total fighting game. I'm aggressive. I don't care. I just straight up don't care. I'm aggressive. And well, that was boss one anyway, so there's not much to talk about. <laughs> Please spare me. <laughs> I won't even think about going after the monster again. I promise. Um, that was certainly a better workout than what I would have gotten looking for a monster. That probably wouldn't even show. Well, now where should I go next? What the? That smoke's coming out of the Star Scarlet. Eh? <laughs> Hold on. That smoke's coming out of the Scarlet Devil Mansion. What is going on? And then we transition. Okay, stop here. <laughs> we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna punch this down over here and leave it right here for now. So. I'll separate this recording, and then we'll continue in a moment. Well, whenever I upload the next one after that. So until then, surf. See you folks in the next one. Uh, I think my uh, excuse me, I think my throat's warmed up now. <laughs>